All right, if you're looking for a cute way to celebrate Valentine's Day that includes fresh fruit, some sweet treats, and of course wine, we've got you covered. Wine and spirits expert Regine T. Rousseau joins us now to walk us through how to create a beautiful dessert bar for the girls. Yes. I love you know, you're always together, it up, right. and you just like, you know, you don't have to be in B-I-T-C-H mode. You no. just want to be in girlfriend love mode. mode. Yeah, girlfriend, yeah. love mode, talking about whatever, and you need something to celebrate around that. Absolutely. And the number one thing is make it beautiful, mm -hmm. right? We appreciate it as women. Men More appreciate so than it the men, too. Though, too. I think you're right. Yeah. And so, you know, if you're doing something for your girlfriends, make it pretty. Mm -hmm. Number two, have variety, right? Because we all spent January um, losing weight yeah. and being healthy. So make sure you have some fresh fruits and vegetables. That's smart. And number three, the most important part. Go on. Yes! <laughs> is caring okay, okay so I have three uh, wines for you today the okay. first one we have to start off with champagne of course yes. you all know how much yes. I love you ladies yes, we love you too. Happy, happy Valentine's Day mm -hmm. mm. okay so good uh, mm -hmm. champagne mm -hmm. lanson they are uh, in Reims, which is uh, the sh uh, capital of champagne so I have a personal love for this per uh, this brand because it was the first champagne I tasted when I landed in Reims. okay oh, so cool. delicious and I tried the rosé for the first time about three weeks ago they had a master class and I was like this says Valentine's Day it tastes like strawberries mm -hmm. and raspberries mm -hmm. it does the color exactly it's perfect so what they did was they served it with berries so take a berry okay I would Either do one? the black I okay. would do the blackberry because like they're too. sweeter yeah mm. and then have the champagne and tell me if your life hasn't changed just a moment <laughs> I would serve this to my Valentine if I had one uh, for oh, breakfast. Mm, that is yeah. so good. It's, it's so, so light, good. and it just oh. picks up all of the flavors in the champagne. I love exactly. wearing it. It's, and it's just simple, right? Yeah. Oh, it does. So yeah. start your day like this. One of my favorite. I think it's about sixty-eight dollars. Okay. Oh, okay. okay. I'm, I'm deserve it. I deserve it. Yeah, yes, we do. you do. We do. Yes, yes you do. Worth it. So next, all right. I don't. I don't have children, but I'm always buying Girl Scout cookies <laughs> from somebody. <laughs> so here's what to do with your Girl Scout cookies. Cookies. Um, set up a, a cookie bar. Yes. I love it. And I'm pairing it with the Ochawa. This is a um, a sweet wine, a Muscadel from the northern part of Spain. Oh, okay. It is absolutely yummy. Now, I know you personally don't like sweet wines, right? Yeah, not but a huge fan. But here's what you want to think about. Your wine should be sweeter than your dessert, right? Oh, okay. Because the, the, the Ooh, food... Okay pull some of the sugar out of the wine. Okay. So for you, if you tried it with one of these lemon cookies, you might enjoy it a little bit more. Okay. Well, I want All the right. shortbread well, cookie. Yeah, I'm a huge, huge suggested. fan of this wine. I do um, like the lemon ones. Also, like each one of these cookies could be paired with its own wine, right? Mm -hmm. Because it has different flavors. But the Ochawa, this Muscadel, has the ability to blend with a lot of different flavors. So mm -hmm. whether you have the lemon or you have the s'mores, it's going to work. I, I like that. I do like I get it. it. See, I get what you're it. saying. Mm -hmm. This is why they pay me the big uh, bucks. <laughs> <laughs> All right. And here's the third Ooh. thing. Chocolate fondue. Mm. So, you know, I watch the show, and you've had some amazing guests talking about wine and chocolate pairing. I'm here for all of it. Mm -hmm. I'm a big fan of bourbon and chocolate, mm. okay? Like Here's why. One thing you want to think about when you're pairing your wine and chocolate, again, you want your wine to be sweeter than your dessert. Okay. So go with a dark chocolate, because if you go with a lighter milk chocolate, the um. wine is going to taste bitter. Oh, yeah. okay. And yeah. that's, you're like, wait, yeah. what is this wine not so good? That's why. Okay. Bourbon, on the other hand, delicious. So this is a Tennessee bourbon, and this is Bibbs and uh, Tucker. Love it, small batch. So if it says bourbon, it has to be at least 51% corn, okay. right? So automatically, it's going to be a little sweeter. Mm -hmm. There's some rye in here, so you have spicy. Yep. Mm -hmm. And the texture of bourbon, to me, goes really, really well with chocolate. So I made you a little chocolate fondue. Okay. Um, I have some rice cakes. I have some uh, Sara Lee pound cake. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I know about you guys liking yeah. that. And then some strawberries. So you can grab a stick and just do your thing. Okay. I'm going to oh, join you. I'm going to have a strawberry. Yeah, you have to. Oh. I'm going to see you for the pound cake. I was going for the pound cake. cake. You can get it. Okay. Or banana. I have banana, too. Okay. All right. So we're going to dip. No double dipping. No double dipping. No double dipping. I said that for myself. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait. We got to stir. We got to stir this chocolate. Stir I it up. Yeah, yeah, there we go. Oh, there you go. You got to get it all there you go. mixed up here. All right, I'm going to go for it. Mm. So 
So we are setting up a cookie bar with Vanille. Mm -hmm. uh, tomorrow we're oh, going fun. to, yeah, I love that place. So we're going to be at, um, oh my God, where's the name, where are we going to be tomorrow? Good question. <laughs> Gildrow, thank you. Hey. <laughs> my amazing, amazing manager, Kirsten Gildrow, 530 to 7. Mm. So we're going to have some wine, we're going to have some cookies, so stop by mm. and visit us. Oh, that is good. Mm -hmm. That is good. Yeah. I don't think really good. good. Too. Oh, and then man. with the, did you try the bourbon? Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm -hmm. I love that. You see, Ray And this is just so simple. It's yeah. just three different bottles of wine. Yes. Some fruit, mm -hmm. some cookies, and a lot of little, oh, come on. It's, it's just good. easy. Easy. Mm. So, As always, this is where we need to understand yeah. the assignment. Yes. I always understand the always assignment. Understand yes, the assignment. you do. Mm. All right, here's Regine's contact information, her social, and her website. She's always having fun. And as you mentioned, you're having a tasting tomorrow. So check her out. You will not be disappointed. Not disappointed at all. Thank you. I love it. Thank Come you. Cheers. 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 Gotta get in on that. I love bourbon love. Yeah. Mm -hmm.